So, hello and welcome to my review of The Incomparable Shakespeare, by any dream necessary. This is the first time I'm hearing of this MC, he's from New York, and he has just dropped his new 10-track mixtape, The Good. The way he rhymes is very old-school inspired, many references to old New York, like the music box from Uncle Ralph on MTV, or KRS-One. He flows over the tracks and is very good with his words, I cannot even remember him cussing once, he's extremely articulate. Furthermore, he makes good topical tracks about a damaged relationship he has with an ex. Always, She was always crying for help and he always felt uh, as if he needed to come to help her on Wolf Cry. Or a modern retelling of Romeo and Juliet with the name Incomparable Shakespeare. Come on. The production is solid. It's modern, it's synthy, but it's far from memorable. The most accessible track is Franklin Jackson, talking about money and blowing it all out on the strip club. He does try to be a little bit smarter about it on this track, trying to explain why he does it, and it's actually pretty good. So let's go on to the negative part. So he sounds a little detached from his songs. He MCs over the top of the tracks, but he's not really got any heart or soul in the rhymes he's saying. I mean, the songs are well written, but they're missing a certain soul as if he was really do feeling what he's saying. He wrote an extremely good piece, but it's just missing that a little bit. And some of his hooks are pretty lame as well, it's like Fresh Air or Shaky Baby. Overall, it's a cool project. The Incomparable Shakespeare can make some really good songs. He's a good songwriter, and on paper it's an amazing project. I just hope for a little bit more soul out of from his production or from his, his voice himself, 4 out of 5.